morning breakfast mini donuts and after this we'll be ready for the hike get your poles almost forgot the most important thing our bear spray never forget this never let's go okay, so this is the starting point of the trail Morin Lake is right over there you can't see nothing and we are going to large valley which is 4.3 kilometers or we can go all the way to Centennial Pass which is 6 we'll decide that on the way let's see what we want to do and that's the way let me actually torch properly there you go you can barely see anything and this is just because of my headlamp so if you're coming at like 5 in the morning or 5 20 something definitely bring a torch because you would be able to see nothing all right let's go so as you can see over here right now the group access is recommended it's not mandatory and group access means you have to be in a group of four or more and when it is mandatory and if you do not comply by it you might face a fine of five thousand dollars just saying so right now it is recommended so we don't need to worry about it we are just two but we also have our bear spray so it should be good let's go how is your experience huh how is your experience we are hiking we have done almost 1.8 kilometers so almost halfway just halfway to go the trail is not that bad it's just that we have started it at very early morning so it's pitch dark but except of that the trail is really good i'll show you that while coming back this is the view at 7 14 in the morning we have done almost 4.3 kilometers and i don't know if you can see or not but right over there there is a very faint glow it seems like it there is going to be an epic sunrise but let's see the clouds are coming in slowly if you can see that they are moving right now so let's hope for the best and there is Devya and I don't know if you can see the color right now but now the colors are showing up yellow we have been traveling in dark so long that we didn't see no colors nothing but I'm pretty sure this is going to be a fantastic day right yeah <laughs> it has been a toll for her but she's doing it so that's what count right okay let's go now let's go How was it? Yeah. Worth it? What about all the crying and whining? Of <laughs> this is what happens when you take untaken paths. There was a small rugged trail coming to your... Look at this. That's amazing. Alright, so you can see a lot of people are there. That is not the end point, that is kind of the midway where there is a wooden small plank of a bridge. And if you come in the morning or like early morning in the dark, you will not be able to see anything while going up. But while coming down, you can see all of it. But let's say that if you want to enjoy and you want to take a lot of breaks and everything, come in the evening time or afternoon time where you can take your breaks and you can take a lot of pictures on the way but the best ones are at the top right yeah, 
so this is what I mean by a switchback it is basically making a lot of zeds on the entire way so she's coming from here she'll go there so this is called one switchback this is the second switchback and like that it is all the way up and it is steep and I know that I'm going down and telling you all this but just you know there are 10 switchbacks in total so if you want to give it a count while you are coming up there are some people who always ask right how far is it how far is it so there you go just tell them to count till 10 switchbacks and then it is easy all right so let's go down more So this is almost the starting of the trail. If you remember, I showed you this board, which showed that travel in group of four or more. And from which point did you give up in the morning? Right over there. It was dark and she was like, nope, I'm not doing it. But well, we pushed through it and yeah, we got to see an epic sunrise, didn't we? Yeah. Dar se the poles are back, the shoes are back, back to the chapels. That is an end to an epic sunrise at Moraine Lake or Large Valley. Moraine Lake is right there. I have been here a lot of times, so it's not beneficial for me to like you know keep on coming and coming and just for that particular view it is breathtaking no doubt but i would better go home because we are tired and yeah that's the end of it i'll show you more in like some time else and she has already started snacking <laughs> thank you for coming with us on this adventure see you on the next one and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to our channel Keep exploring.